Give me those tire irons. Have you out in the jiffy, kid? We get this off in the jiffy. Right. Hey, hey, hey! What's You want to tear my sweater? Five minutes to the nightly news. Five, four, three, two, one. Hello, everyone. My name is Gary O'Donnell. This is the nightly news for Thursday, July 1st. Uh, it's a beautiful day outside. The weather is very nice today. Um, we will be getting a report from our weather girl, Shelly Long. Uh, later in the program, how the mighty have fallen. Shelly used to be a actress. She's now our local weather girl. She's very good at it. Today we're going to be discussing several topics, including President Obama, Barack Obama, and his approval ratings declining at a steady face. Pace, I mean. Excuse me. Prompter. We are also going to be discussing um, sex ed. I'm sorry, we're going to be discussing sex ed. I'm talking to my friend over here. What? Oh, we are not going to be discussing sex. That is, that is for tomorrow's program. Tomorrow's program we will be discussing sex ed. No, now I'm actually saying sex ed. This is so confusing. Uh, here's a little story that came out of Indonesia. There seems to be a smoking baby. Two and a half years old, and she has a, or it could be a he, I really don't know. Uh, our Indonesian correspondent actually got flogged this morning. So, we're getting kind of uh, news. We're getting reports to the wire. Not the HBO television show, mind you, but... Okay. Sorry. Getting yelled at by my superiors. There's a smoking baby, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I don't know why it's smoking. What the hell it's smoking for? It's two and a half years old. It's kind of young, but... And if it doesn't get a cigarette, it starts crying. So, the Parenting 101 says to give it a cigarette. Because that's a good idea. Let's move on to the world of sports, where LeBron James is going to be a free agent. No, it does not mean that he's going to be an agent for the CIA. It means that he's going to be able to go to any team that he wants. I personally would like to see him play for the New York Yankees. Excuse me? Oh. Yankees is baseball. And what is LeBron? Basketball. So, that's... Somebody better get it right. Somebody's has my no notes wrong. Somebody's giving me the wrong information. Unbelievable. Gary O'Donnell knows his sports. Let's just be serious about that. Gary O'Donnell also knows his barbecue. And, uh... Today's barbecue tip is... When skewing shrimp... Make sure that you put the shrimp onto the skewer. In. So that's that. That's Gary O'Donnell's barbecue tip of the day, July 1st. Let's see what else is in the news here. Oh, there seems to be some olive oil spilled in the Gulf Coast. Uh, I like olive oil. I also like coconut oil, which um, is low in fatty acids. So... That's Gary O'Donnell's health tip for the day. Anyway, uh, oh, here's a little tidbit that just came over the wires. And again, not the HBO show. Okay. So I was told that that wasn't funny the second time. Or the first time. No, never say it again. I'm getting the kibosh. Anyway, 
Uh, there was a uh, prehistoric whale-eating beast discovered today. Uh, in our household, we like to call that the neighbors. Anyway, moving on. Uh, oh, in entertainment news, there is a movie sweeping the nation called Toy Story 3. It is uh, about a cowboy and an, and an astronaut who have sexual relations. No, no it's not. It is about... Okay, I'm now told to move on. I just scared the children everywhere. Scary O'Donnell? I think I just said Scary O'Donnell. It's not scary, it's Gary. Anyway, uh, another news, beets are delicious. So, we will be having a health correspondent come in tomorrow to tell us about the nutritional values of beets. Uh, I personally don't like them. I think they taste like rubber. Not rubber from a tire, mind you, but a condom. Sticking a condom into your... Ah, uh, sorry. I think I just got fired. Yeah, I did. I'm out. This is my last broadcast, ladies and gentlemen. Gary O'Donnell, signing off. I hope everyone has a great knife. Not knife, life. If you have a knife, stick it in my chest. I'm out of the job. Gary O'Donnell, sayonara. <laughs>